it's time for a sweet tea Timu haul. Da, da, da. Here we go again. Yes, we have another Timu haul. I'm going to try to get in here without cutting things. It looked like I was about to cut something here. I don't want to do that. Ah! Go up the side. Okay. Let's see what we got here. I'm going to pull. Oh, good. I'm good then. Okay. I'm going to start with this guy here. In fact, on my list here, I'm going to try to go down the list and do them in the order that I have written them. Well, good luck to me. What I have here, I love how things have a little bit of, they have a little bit of, uh, yeah, English on it. Cover inside and then all Chinese. And so, yeah. But this is what is called a toiletry pouch. It is the style Daisy. In fact, it's wine red flowers. When I went back on there to look this one up, um, it was not there any longer, but they did have uh, different ones that you can choose from other than these right here. And it's called a travel toiletry pouch. I thought this was precious and you're not going to believe the price that I paid for it. This is extremely cool. This has got an apps, uh, uh, really, a rubber label. That is so cool. All right, we're going to open this thing up. It is, okay, we do have a hook. Awesomeness. We have Velcro, which is fantastic. Oh, my gracious, I am loving this. Yes, we have a zippered plastic pouch see-through so you can see what's in there i can put tweezers i can put little shavers i can put all kinds of little things in here i can put lens cleaner uh little uh pouches in there moist towelettes you can put all kinds of things in there then i'm looking at the middle here to see what's what you have two mesh pouches here so you can stick items in there then you've got this big pouch here, which not only has this pouch here, it's got one, two, three, three different sections to slide things in like masks or uh, face cleaning cloths. You can put cotton balls in here. I see little areas on the side that would hold, hold bottles. See that right there, that there, and then this one over here. And then you've got the main little pouch down here. Plus, it's mesh here so you can see what's up top. There. That is awesome. So, it is so cool. It has a flipping handle and a pouch on the back. Oh my gosh, can it have any more? Does it need any more? No. I'm so surprised that it's got all of these compartments. These are fabulous. Let's look at that picture again to see what they've done. They put bottles and stuff in there, toothpaste, toothbrush, little uh, vials of things, little pads. Yes. Do you know how much I paid for this? $1.68. I paid $1.68 for this. If you go to Walmart, you're going to pay a heck of a lot more than $1.68 for this. This was a good deal. And I mean a good and wowzers. Let's see if I can find. Oh, that was easy. He's right here. I got a diamond painting here. He's a little crimped too. I'm a little annoyed by that, but hey, it's not a game changer. Let's get him open and get him out so he can get loosened up. I'm going to scoot my Timu bag over just a little bit. Scoot that over a little bit. Try to get the sticky part off of my finger, and we have a typical toolkit with a few baggies. That's all I'm going to say on that. That's all you need to do this diamond painting. If you've never done a diamond painting before and you're wanting to start a diamond painting, and you get this kit, use it. And the reason why I want to say that is if you find that you don't, don't like the craft, you have not put any more than that into it. Um, then you can go, if you love the craft, you're going to get more kits, you're going to get pens, you're going to get trays, whatever you want to do your diamond painting in the way you want to do it. 
I'm just saying. <laughs> there you go. This one is a full round, and we have got gorgeous colors. I see some darks in there, but a lot of greens and oranges and yellows. I even see pinks. Yes. <laughs> Let's get him. This one here I did not have. I've got a, a, a good many um, gnome pictures. I call them gnomes, and I will forever call them gnomes. Whether I can see their eyes or not, they are gnomes to me. Now let's see what we got here. Oh, it's so cute. That is just precious. It says it's one set 5D. Oh, excuse me. I never read you the the description on the um, cosmetic bag. Portable hanging toiletry bag with hook, travel storage bag, folding, handheld cosmetic bag for $1.68. This is called one set 5D DIY Christmas diamond painting kits for adults full round drill. 11.81 by 15.75. That is a 30 by 40. Actually, it's a 40 by 30. 40 by 30. And these are gnomes in pots. And why it says Christmas, I think it's because there are a few of these to choose from. This is the one that I chose because I love these terracotta pots. They are fabulous. And the, oh, the flowers are gorgeous. Look at the drill field. We have... Guide circles, some people call them training wheels, but that's okay. I don't have a problem with that. My only problem will be if the drill is not big enough to cover the circle, and then it, you end up seeing it. 24 colors. We do have the DMC codes here. Now, we have got numerical, 1 through 8 consecutive, then at 9 starts A, and then it goes down alphabetically down to W. So you're missing some of the alphabet within there, but there's 24 uh, colors there. We do have the thumbnail up at the top, and we do have a legend on this side with another thumbnail, believe it or not. Awesomeness. Awesomeness. I'm going to try get it to just relax a little bit more. And what it's going to start doing now, it's a little crinkled on the edge there. It got crimped in shipping and all of whatever it's been through in its life so far at the manufacturer and then at the distributor. Yeah, it's been farther than I've ever gone in my life. Think about this, guys. These paintings, they travel. They travel more than, they travel more than I do. But there you go. He is so, they are so, so cute with the butterflies going on now. And there's a bee or two. There's a bee. There's a bee. All right. That goes there. I'm going to put that right there. $2.24 for those gorgeous gnomes. Now, let's see if I can find what I'm looking for next. Oh, these are fabulous. All right, before I get into un to crimping or uncrimping all of this noisy plastic here, I'm going to read this to you. Eight pieces. You see, there's four here. There's four there. They're a gorgeous color, rainbow. It says, eight pieces, beach towel clips, plastic chair pegs for holding towels. I call it multicolored. $3.05 is what I bought them for. You cannot buy eight beach clips, beach towel clips, anywhere other than probably Timu for that price. Three dollars and five cents. I'm going to bring this out. We're going to scoot one off the paper here like so. They are constructed like that. These are plastic. Hey, an exerciser. Bother me, and I will clip you. All right. I'm loving it. Put your beach towel on your chair. Attach that clip to the top to hold it. Then you can sit down, and you've got your clip on your chair, and your beach towel is being held. I am a big fan of beach towel clips. Fantastic. Not only do you get four of them, you get eight of them. And they're $3.05 whenever I bought them. 
you might want to get on there and see if they're any cheaper because just like Amazon, and I know I mentioned Amazon a lot on Timu haul orders and videos, but the reason being is Timu is, I consider Timu like the Chinese Amazon. It's, you're going to have a different, you got different sellers on there. They sell things for the same, for different prices. You might see the same item noted at a different seller for a cheaper price. Don't buy that first thing before you put it in the cart, then go looking for it again and see if you can find it any cheaper. That's how I work Amazon. I will go and find the cheapest price on everything, look at the reviews, and make sure the reviews are good. I'm not going to buy something if it's got like a one star. You wouldn't, right? Use a little common sense. Everybody should. i got to get going here. All right. That $3.05, now I am going to this right here. I showed a cute flag that I got. I'd hoped that this was a diamond painting, but no, it was a flag. And it's my Hello Summer Kitty in the little uh, uh, tire here with his watermelon drink and the palm trees going on. Well, guess what? I don't have a garden flag holder. So guess what? I do now. Ta-da! Okay, now I am not sure about setting this up, but I will read this to you. One piece garden flag stand with two stoppers and one anti-wind clip. 85 by 38 centimeters black. $5.29 is what I paid for it. I don't think you can beat that with a stick. Now here's the different pieces that come with it. So it comes with, we, it comes with two stoppers. So there's my stoppers, and it comes with an anti-wind clip, so that it won't blow your flag around. So I'm just going to show you the components of this. Here's your components, and I am going to eventually get that thing put together with the flag on it, and I will take a picture of it and show you that. I'm going to set this over to the side, not wanting to lose all the accoutrements. That's $5.29 for that. Now, I'm digging. <laughs> I'm digging. Here we go. I'm going to be curious if this thing works, but all right. I had to get me this one-piece automatic. Whoa. I love it. What in the world? Okay, this is quite interesting. These are the components of all this. So I'm gonna to have to put this together somehow. But what this is, is a uh, one-piece automatic toothpick dispenser press type holder, and I got it in the blue. Actually, it's teal, but kinda of does look like blue on the camera there. $1.57. What it's gonna do for me, is there's gonna be this little button right here. It's gonna be inside right there. And with all the mechanisms all attached there, I'm gonna press that button and it's going to pop a toothpick up for me. This is another thing that I'll have to show you later. Because I'm, I'm under a time constraint right now on getting this video done. So I'm going to want to go ahead and work everything through. I'm going to set that right there for now. We will show you that later. What do I got next? Oh, really? I have to go for that one, huh? Wow. Let's see if I can get it out without having to move anything. I have been looking for this. I was, for my vacation, I like to buy water. I like to buy purified water uh, to drink. And I have been on the lookout for a container that I can actually hold and dispense water from. Now, they do have, some some grocery stores do carry the, the containers of water with a spout. But I wanted something that... I could buy that was relatively inexpensive and would hold water or Kool-Aid or whatever I want to put in it. That just shows it dispensing into a glass. Okay. All right. And here is the actual spout here. Okay. Okay. Nice. Okay, so let's see. It would be like that. And somehow I'm going to get this plugged into this. 
hole. Okay, so this is going to come off. That's going to go in. This is going to be inside and screwed tight. And then this is going to sit out like this, and you're going to be able to do this, I think. Either that or it's going to turn this way, and it's going to go like that. That makes sense. So it's going to go, it's going to be like that, and then you're going to dispense like that, possibly. I'll have to check that later. But this is called a one-piece 3.5 liters uh, refrigerator cold kettle with faucet. $4.12. I didn't have a problem with that. I saw one on Walmart that looked more like a big old jug, and it was like 15 bucks. I'm like, you know what? I don't really want to spend 15 bucks on this when I can, you know, spend just a little bit less. This is not very big, but when you think about it, if you keep filling it up with water, you're going to have water for your coffee or whatever, your Kool-Aid, just whatnot. If you're wanting a cold cup of water or glass of water, there you go. You can make Kool-Aid, you can do Kool-Aid, you can do sweet tea, you can do lemonade, you can do whatever you want. That'll work. I like it. Four dollars. I feel like it's a little small, but I opted for the 3.5 liter. The picture looked a little bit bigger, but you know, sometimes it's deceiving. That looks pretty big right there when you look at the camera, but there you go. 3.5 liter cold kettle is what it's called with a faucet. Pretty cool. Now, guess what I got? I got me another luminous pen. Ah, and it's got metal tips to it. This is called Diamond Painting New Luminous Pen Resin Metal, metal Pen Head Tool Set Style B for Blue. B for Blue. I love these luminous pens and they do shine. I've got a purple one and I've got a multicolored one. It's like a like a snow white inside with different uh, rainbow colors in it. Oh, it's beautiful. And it shines at night. It just has a glorious time. So when I cut all the lights off and go into bed, I see my pen over there going, good night. Yes, I love this blue one though. It's going to be gorgeous. Beautiful, luminous. So pretty. I love these pens. This one comes with the metal tips in stainless steel. My sweet spot is a six placer. Yes, but it looks like it has got like a nine placer, a six placer, a straightener, a three placer, an angle tip, and a round tip. I'm not going to take those out. They do have, you can tell, they have the little rubber rings in there. This set together was $8.91. Get on Amazon. It's comparable. I'm just telling you, it's comparable. So, yeah, $8.91. This is Style B. This is blue. Luminous. Love it. All right. What have I got now? Oh, I'm actually going to do this little guy here before I do the last one. I have been wanting a lot of tips. I just like having metal tips. I found this set. I thought it was great because it's kind of in the gold color. And it is three pieces, a deluxe metal diamond painting tool set, 369. The goose drank wine, da, 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 da. Yeah, it's a 369, which is awesome. I might have to try the nine and see if I can use it. And it's got the spare rings to it. I love the fact that these come in these little containers. These are awesome. You can use these for other things, too. That was $1.89, guys, for three tips, metal, gold, $1.89. So, awesomeness. And I've got one more thing, guys. I am hustling to get all of this Timu haul done in one. And I'm sorry, I am just taking all of your spare time. I had to get in here and show you one more thing. And it is a diamond painting. And it says, unlock your creativity with these. A set of diamond painting, I love this, with beer bottle patterns. 30 by 40 centimeters, 12 by 16 inch. So anytime you see 12 by 16 inch, it's 30 by 40. It is a full round. Here are the colors. If I can get them turned around, you see a bunch of pinks and blues and greens and caramels. And yes, yellows. All kinds of stuff in there with a typical toolkit. That goes over there. It's crunched up. It needs 
some TLC. And yes, if you're seeing it, you know exactly what I'm talking about. It is not beer bottles. The price that I paid for it is $3.81 for a 30 by 40. You cannot beat that. I wanted the Coke bottles. I've been seeing Coke bottles. I love Coke bottles. They are gorgeous. I used to drink Coke, but I'm a Pepsi girl and a cheer wine girl and a sweet tea girl and a ginger ale girl. And sometimes I'll drink Coke. 21 colors, DMC codes, two legends, an itty bitty little thumbnail, and it's Coke bottles. Oh my gosh, they're going to be so pretty. It has been crimped beyond belief. I can't believe all the crimp that's on this poor thing. It has been so far, and it's gotten so wrinkled. We are going to try our darndest to help him relax. There you go. Awesomeness. 30 by 40. Yes, 21 colors. All alphabetical, not in order, with DMC codes. You can't beat it. There's a bunch of color blocking on there. There's the drill field. You can see all that confetti on there, too. I don't know if all of this is going to come out. It might. I'm curious to see. This will be really cool. That is awesome. But yeah, $3.81. So, we've got that canvas there. We've got our pen set. We've got our three metal chip set. We've got our toothpick uh, dispenser. We've got our 3.5 liter um, cold kettle is what that's called. We've got our beach towel clips, eight piece. We have got our flag holder, our gnomes, and we have got our fabulous travel toiletry bag. That was $1.68, guys. Cannot believe it. I can't believe all this. This was awesome. This honestly was awesome, and it cost me less than $35. All of this gorgeousness. Yes. So, you know what I'm going to say. I'm going to say, get on Timu. You're going to find, goodness knows, if you can't find something you want on Timu, then I'm Marilyn Monroe. Go to Timu. Yes, it might take a little longer to get to you, but if the price is right, then it's worth the time to get to you. I'm just saying, and if you ever have a problem with anything on Timmy's website, go to their customer service, email them, and let them know they will make it right for you. Okay? There you go. I love you guys. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit that all not notification bell. It'll alert you every time I happen to get another video out. And usually it's, I try to do one every day if I'm lucky. We'll see how I'm feeling tomorrow. I had a procedure today, so I'm right now I'm I'm okay, but we don't know we don't know what tomorrow brings. So life goes on. I'll pray for you. You pray for me. Thank you so much to all of my subscribers and viewers. Love you guys. And hug somebody today. Tell them that you love them. Go out and out in the world and smile. Hey, it's cheap and it helps the world. I love you. Don't ever forget it. Everything's better with sweet tea and Timu. Ta-ta for now, guys.